Good afternoon, good evening, good morning. Hello, how is everyone doing? Oh. Sorry, just rushing around to get ready because I wasn't quite ready for the stream. I've been, um, got paint all over. Well, I think I scrubbed it off now because I had a shower. Um, but I've been spray painting part of a car. Well, not part of a car. Well, it is part of a car. I was missing... Part of my um, wing mirror came off ages ago on the motorway and it got lost. So I ordered a new one, like it was a molded piece, but it wasn't in the color because I couldn't get hold of the one in my color for anything cheap enough. Um, so I got like a, a molded one that was primed. So I've been spray painting it for the past couple of hours. I actually have to like do a few coats and let it dry 15 minutes between. So, uh, so I was just making sure that <laughs> i done the last one, so I'm a bit warm, everyone, so I apologise if I get a bit shiny. Um, but I had a shower just before the stream, and then just did one more coat before I came on the stream. Uh, so how is everyone? Is everyone good? Hopefully you all are. Um, yes, thank you. Um, two seconds. Right, I've put the fan on, as you suggested, Frankie, thank you. Um, yes, Bob, I've done it. Just been, it's not that it has been really cold here today. I've been wearing a cardigan most of the day. It's been tipping down with rain. Don't know what it's like where you've been, Frankie. Bob, you don't need to answer that because I know that you're in the same town as me, as you live with me. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I don't know what the weather's been like where you are uh, up there, Frankie. I mean, it's definitely been warm here. Um... A cold, sorry, cold here, and now I'm warm. But anyway, today we are going to do a, another build challenge. Um, I know I seem to be doing them a lot. Uh, oh, and Bob, if you're listening, uh, when you get home, don't let the dog straight out um, because I've spray painted that part of the car thingy in the conservatory, so I don't want him to get his fur all over it. Um, okay, fair enough, Frankie. That's cool. How is things going? Um, work been going okay? Uh, but anyway, yes, so we're building a house. I've already built the shell because that's the bit that normally takes me the time because I'm trying to figure out what to do. Um, so I've built a basic shell of a house. Now I'm thinking it probably doesn't work as well as I need it to. I might just change it slightly to open up this um, but yeah that's my plan is to do this challenge which is every home a different style so this challenge is going to be slightly different from yesterday so yesterday's it was every um no i can't remember if i said that right but anyway every room is a different style this one's a bit different whereby there's a lot more styles that we can pick from and most of the styles, well, it's not more than the packs, but most of the styles will have something in it that's useful, but then some of them don't. So it's, it's, it is different from yesterday's because a pack doesn't equal a style. So that's what the plan will be. So I'm just going to, I'll switch over to the other screen so you can see what I mean. Um, let's switch over now. Yes, Bob. Well, I don't want his fur going on. It's already had three hairs on it. Um, when I was just spray painting it in there on my own, I had to wipe off after it and then repaint over it. So, um, yeah, I don't really want more hairs on it. Um, but yeah, so these are the different styles that we've got um, in The Sims 4. Basics, Contemporary, Patio, Cosmolux, Double Gallery, French Country, Farmhouse, Mission, Mid-Century, Industrial, Modern... Queen Anne, Shotgun, Suburban, Contempo, Storybook, Boho, Island and Garden. So these are these will be our options for this thing. Obviously we're not going to pick it ourselves. We're just going to 
get it to choose for us. So uh, let me switch over to the game then and you tell me if the sound is okay. And um, then we can get on with it. So hopefully you can hear that. Oh, I'm gonna turn off my catch card. I don't need catch card on. There is some music playing, hopefully nice and quiet as usual. I said I built the shell. I'm not quite sure I like it that much though. Might make that a bit bigger. I mean, I would do open plan, but the problem is it's a bit difficult with open plan because when you're spinning for each room, it doesn't make as much sense. So my plan is to be, this is our entrance hallway into a living area, dining room here, which actually I might make another bit tile smaller it doesn't need to be that big you've got the kitchen here at the front bedroom at the back with a bathroom here which will be a family bathroom rather than an ensuite could make it ensuite because it's only one bedroom but if you've got visitors you don't want them walking through your bedroom do you not that it matters in the sims so yeah that's our that's our shell i haven't done anything with it um it's on this lot i've checked this is the front of the lot so that's good uh so yeah Hopefully the frame rate won't drop too much. I'm hoping it won't anyway. I have still got the uh, view distance quite low just to stop it from lagging slightly. So as usual, our first step will be to do the outside of the house, which is going to include... Now, I want a people's opinions. So last time I did the whole of the outside is one thing. Should it be the outside of the house itself is one thing and then like the back garden is another thing what's your opinions on that one i know you always will say whatever you feel like but i want opinions on it to know what everyone thinks Because obviously the outside walls and windows and the roof would be to say one style. I've really done this in a horrible shape. It's going to be really difficult to roof that. <laughs> Maybe we make this bigger here. Then that could. Be, uh, then, yeah, I've definitely not done that very well. So really difficult to roof. So maybe we move you back by one move you over and move you back by one make you that one yeah I just want to know opinions really I know everyone always says oh it's your challenge you can do what you like but I just want to know what everyone thinks that'll make it easier to just roof and do a roof there roof there yeah that's cool <coughs> I know you've probably got a bit of lag Bob so I'll just sort of wait for you to confirm whether you can hear it and whether and what your opinion is on that decision or that um option um, I know if I get to make incisions so that's why I normally um, ask for opinions on it um, but if no one has an opinion then that's fine I just like to know what people think no nothing no one's got an opinion. Okay, that's fine. So I'm going to go with, I think, the outside shell of the house with the roof and the windows and the door is one style. The front garden... Mm, and the garden's in another style, I think. Yeah, that's going to be my opinion. That's what I'm going to do. Okay. So let's spin then for the first so the with the shell of the building what we're going to do on the outside uh, so I said we've got our different styles so let's bring that window up so this is what we've got so let's hope for something good we'll spin and see what we get um mid-century okay that shouldn't be too difficult I don't think um, I'm going to make it more difficult. I'm going to remove each one when we've done it so we can't have the same one twice. So let's go. Mid-century for the outside of the building. This is where I don't have anything for mid-century, isn't it? So let's switch back to the game. So you can't see it very well, but under the filter here, 
there is a filter called styles um, you can just see some of them there um, but yeah so we're gonna pick mid-century and see what wallpapers we get we get a fair few wallpapers so that's not too bad I'm pretty happy with that okay don't worry Bob it's fine so we got I think we'll go for probably oh I quite like the brick oh we can make it country cottagey type thing not sure that's really mid-century but I'm thinking so we've got um, I don't like that paneling though we could go would it look weird with like this on here Ugh, why didn't and then a different thing on here maybe would this work hmm so hopefully have we got some roofs Hmm. not overly so uh, we have to put a roof on it because these don't really fall under anything so these are pretty much free to use oh let's put the walls up for a second uh, yes that works not sure what's gonna work there this will work on this side like a so so there bring you down by one notch I think we want you a bit lower then this side we might have to do like a this type of roof or maybe actually no I think what I might do that section is bigger maybe we roof that first this way and we'll bring it down a second and it looks huge but yeah that might work better that way actually I think bring you down Whoop. and if we bring you back so I don't know whether everyone knows a little hint for this where you've got this overhang Obviously you can pull back the eaves on all on this side or all the sides. If you hold shift you can pull it back on just one side. So the best thing to do is to try and reduce this as much as possible. Either um, do it all the way across, which you can do. Some simmers do that, but I don't like I don't the look of I don't like the look of it all the way across necessarily, so I do the little trick. If you bring it back to here, take the eave off of this side, and then you copy it and put one there. Take the eve off of here and just stretch it out and there we go. It's not perfect, but it's near as damn it. I don't think I could take this back any further, can I? Not really, unless we No, yeah. I just prefer that over what we had, to be honest. I'm not sure I like the roof anyway, but Mm. what I might actually do because um, I might bring that in by one bring you into there that that ruins everything there doesn't it yeah I kind of don't want I know that would be weird to do this oh I think I prefer that to be honest. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Is that weird? I think it looks a bit better like that actually. I put the roof on. So we have to change the roof in a minute because we've only got one style of roof we can use. That, does that work better? Maybe. Kitchen's can be a bit of a weird shape, but what we can do is we can put like a um, like a cupboard there. <laughs> yeah, I think that'll work. Cool. Then we put a roof on here. Put 
probably want to have it about the same pitch as that one, don't we, to be honest? Yeah, and then we want you to be on the back here. Or I might do on the back a hip dirt. Yeah, this roof. Like an extension type thing. If we bring you back by one. There we go. Yeah, I think that looks better. That's cool. Cool. Right. That's our shell done, I think. Oh. So the only roof covering that we have for mid uh, for mid century is this. So we get to have a nice grass roof. Any other colours of it actually? Put it with flowers on it. I suppose. That's cool, I like that. We have quite a few windows in mid century, so that's quite good. Oh, I quite like these. Right now, this is going to be the kitchen, so I have to be careful because um, the counters. Ooh. The blue really offsets the green, doesn't it? Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So this is our dining room. Why does that seem so much lower? Oh, it's there. Okay. Okay, have another window here. Don't know why I'm going for the default style. We don't need to. I just quite liked the colour. <laughs> Let's see what else. So we've got the bedroom here, so we need one in the bedroom. What style? What's this one like? Maybe we do this one. Give it a slightly different style at the back. Cool. Then we've got living room here. So we want one here I reckon. Maybe a small one here in the bathroom. I don't think we need many more windows than that to be honest. Maybe we put another one here. This is the bedroom isn't it? Yeah. There would be perfect. It's right in the middle. And then I think we might have... Oh no. I was going to say we might have a door there but that's the bathroom. We don't want a door out in the bathroom do we? Maybe there. Okay. Well thank you Frankie. I'm glad you like it. <laughs> I think that's going to do. Yeah. So we need a door, which we have loads again. Oh, we can match the colour of the windows with the door. Um, I know there are swatches, so I could just scroll through them, but I'm just not very good at that. Um, unfortunately, with the 60% keyboard I have, it's not as easy. <laughs> But maybe we go for that type of door. What other doors have we got? Oh, I haven't put um, move objects on. We're going to need that one. Cool. Quite like that door, actually. I think it would work. What other colour swatches on the windows, just in case? I think I quite like the blue, to be honest. I don't know what your opinions are, but I quite like it. Have we got any ceiling no we haven't got any roof stuff um yeah oh so the we have a porch oh do we have any stairs do we have any stairs well we don't have any stairs so we know we now can't do any steps up so the most we can do is one one uh, thing there we have no trim oh the music just suddenly got louder for me uh what we have some floors, which is good. That's always good. Do we want... Yeah, I like the blue too, Bob. <laughs> oh, we could do... Oh, that's what I can do. Uh, let's put... A... What am I doing? Where am I? Who am I? What am I doing? Uh, there it is. Is it weird, super weird, to have like a exit out of... Oh, do we have any columns under mid-century? I haven't checked, to be honest. We do. Is it super weird to like put a patio coming out of the bedroom? I don't think it is, is it? Have we got any fences? We have some fences. They're not great fences, but we have some. Maybe a light colour? What other ones have we got? Oh, I don't like them. 
Unless they come in a nice light colour. Maybe white. Ooh. Possibly. Possibly. It's kind of becoming a bit of a... A mishmash, isn't it? Because, um... We... Maybe there. Already it's becoming a bit of a mishmash. Because we've already got, like... What am I, oh my god, I can't talk. It's like a cottagey theme on the outside of the house, but then, um... We've kind of turned it into also modern-ish. I think if we can have blue... We can have a blue door there. Maybe that one. It's a bit dark, but there, that's not too weird, I don't think. Then we can put the same flooring on there. There we go. And then we can pick up that same fencing and we put it here. We have columns. What columns did I say I had? Mid-century. Some pretty standard ones, to be honest. Can I... Oh, we can do... I like doing this. Um, this gives it a bit of edge. I'm probably not going to put a... I won't put one there, actually, because that's... I'm thinking that's like almost like an extension. Weak! All right, let's put a roof on this house. On this, well, not house here. I want to put a something here, possibly. I was going to do like a pergola style roof, but unfortunately, that's not going to work now. So, can we do anything like this? Would this work? Kind of. Bring back that Eve. Maybe copy that and put it. There, push you to there. That's fine to there. Push you to there. Bring you in. Yeah, that will work. We obviously have to put this type of roof on it. There we go. Not sure I like this here. Let's bring you in because that that will be hidden then. Ugh. Could be turd? No, it's not going to help. Yeah, that'll do. Let's pretend you can't see that. Have we got any trims for mid-century? No trims for the roof. That's fine. I think that works, though. I think that's good. We'll do the gardens last. Hopefully. Hopefully we'll get, like, backyard, uh, like, garden patio stuff. So our first room technically is the entrance hall, but I'm going to leave that for now. I'm actually going to do the kitchen first, I think. So let's see what we get for the kitchen. Here we are again. Let's see. Oh, did I press up? I pressed update. What was it we just had? We just had mid-century, didn't we? Yeah. Oh, if mid-century comes up again, I have to remove it again just because I uh, messed up. Then industrial for the kitchen. Okay. So industrial for the kitchen should work. Hopefully. Let's see. Show all. Not mid-century. Come on. Industrial. We should, in theory, have stuff for mid uh, for Yeah, here we go, look. Proper industrial type counters. So we've definitely got them. That's good. Um thinking along this wall at least. Maybe corner pieces in yeah then we maybe let's see what we got have we got any enough appliances I bet we haven't got the appliances <gasps> oh no we don't get any appliances under industrial oh dear oh dear so we don't get any cooker or fridge or anything to be honest uh, do we get a door at least to put on the kitchen? Because we started with the kitchen, we have to go from there. Um, 
think I'm going to end up doing a renovation of this house because I quite like the outside of it and now it's being ruined by the inside. Uh, maybe we go brown. I think the grey works better with the industrial to be honest. Have we got any wallpapers under industrial? We do. Brick mainly. Doesn't really match with what we've got on the outside but it would work. Nice brick walling. Some floors. Industrial. Stone. Maybe like a concrete. Don't really want a um, wood uh, metal floor, so we'll probably just do. Or we could do like a wooden. I think con I think I prefer the concrete to be honest. So like the polished concrete. Yeah, let's do that. So I'm not really sure what to put in this kitchen now because we have no appliances. We can put in a little table, possibly. We have any tables? Oh, we do. We've got some tables here. Like, maybe a little table in the corner here. Any, like, seats? Um, yes. Maybe something like that. We could put a cooker hood in, because we do have a cooker hood. Um, like, oh. Cooker hood, so we pretend that there's a cooker there. Do we have any bins? Let's look under bins. Only this. So do we want, we need a bin in the kitchen, so can we size down this? Yeah. I thought I'd turn move objects on. Move objects is on. That was weird. Because we can't have a normal bin, we'll put a dumpster in here. That's cool. They've got that. That's a necessity. They've got somewhere to sit. Any sinks? Oh, we have some sinks. Ugh. Not really what I wanted. <laughs> no! Can we raise you up ever so slow? Oh, no, we don't want to make you bigger. Always press the wrong button. Okay, we've got a sink there, like a raised sink. Yeah, there we go. You'd never know. It looks like it's meant to be like that. What else have we got? Anything else under kitchen? We don't have any upper cabinets. We have no... Yeah. What about lighting? Have we got any lighting? We have quite a bit of lighting, so that's something. <laughs> we can put like a really cool installation up here, maybe. That maybe. Have we got any hanging lights? We do. That's too big. It's a random, just a bulb. Maybe we just put one of these in. Like in the middle of the kitchen to light everything. That's way too much light, I think. Just one of them then. What have we got for decoration? Batu, Batu. Pantry. That could have gone in there. I didn't put that table in. Did I have any arches? I do. Mm, maybe, maybe actually. We move you, we take you out, and then I want to put... This is part of the... Ooh, no, it's not what I meant to copy. We put you in here. Copy the floor. Oh, what do you put in there? That's fine. they got a single single um, little uh, thingy to sit on. Industrial. Little pantry can go in here. I swear, why? I swear, move objects keeps turning off. 
Oops, wrong button. It does. So annoying. That's a pantry. There we go. Actually, we can put another. We can put a chair there. You just have to move every time you want to get into the pantry. How about a rug? Have we got any rugs under industrial? Um, all items. This is all industrial. Interesting. We do have this. Uh, that's a lot of it's Batu stuff, isn't it? Oh, like some. It's interesting that my move objects keeps turning itself off. That's going to be really annoying. Nothing I can do about it though. It might be one of the mods that I've got installed. I want something small for one of these walls, possibly. Oh no. Let's try putting... I know, it's weird. I don't know why it keeps doing it. We'll put maybe some pipes there to make it look more industrial. You can't cook in here, but at least um, files. Do we need files? I don't think we need files in here. Anything else we can put in that might look... Maybe just put a box in just to make it... Fish of the day? No. Worn out fish of the day. Maybe a hanging plant in the corner. Maybe above the table actually would look better. Be a bit annoying, but you know. I think that's it. I think that's our, our kitchen. Um, oh, we have a utensil rack. We can put that in behind the, the would-be oven. At least that's something. Just trying to see if there's anything else. No, that's it, I think, for industrial. Okay. So that is our dining room. Our living room. Oh my god, I can't even talk. Our kitchen. Which, to be honest, isn't a bad room if it was if it had all the um, items in it. I quite like sort of the industrial feel. But um, unfortunately we don't have everything, so. So let's do dining room then, I suppose. So this is our dining room. I'll do living area next, I think. Um, let's switch screens and see. Let's see what we get for our modern. Okay. We haven't done modern, no, we did mid-century, which is there. Can I remove mid-century? No. Okay. I'll have to wait until I get it. So modern for our dining room, which will be relatively easy. Uh, modern, modern, modern. So we've got quite a lot of the falls under modern, so that's always good. Let's go to our actual dining room thing and see what we've got. Table. So we've got loads of them. This is all modern stuff. Look at it all. Seems like an outdoor table. Nice little glass table, possibly. We're going modern. Although I quite like that one actually. Might do that. What colours does that come in? Don't want it in black, really. Maybe in that wood colour? That would work. So we've got a few that f also fell under the um, industrial here. So I'm thinking these ones for this room, though. Let's see what colours. Do we have a closer match on a colour? Probably not. Though I quite like the fact they've got like a blue trim. I need to, let's put some lights in because I need to see what we're doing in here. Ceiling lights. Have we got any good modern ceiling lights? I don't like that. Maybe. That's more like industrial. So weird. Oh, I don't like that. These are huge, these things. I don't like any of these, to be honest. But I'm going to put this in just to give me a bit of light because I need some light. 
feel that one that one matches the colour of the table better. Maybe like that. Oh, let's see if we got a good door. Have we got any good doors under modern? Anyone know? Modern, modern, modern. Loads of doors. Which is good because this is a, quite a. See, look, it's my move object. I reckon it's one of the mods I've put in. Come on, I didn't type that right. Okay. <laughs> Actually, do we have any bars? We do, but they're humongous. How's this modern? How does this fall under the modern umbrella? I don't really understand that. I wouldn't say that was modern. That's more traditional in my eyes. Hey, what do I know? Any modern wallpapers? Loads of them. Ooh, we could go... Is there like a lighter colour of this one? Thinking like a feature wall. Stop trying to stop deleting my door. Maybe like, oh, why are you deleting my door? Quite like the fact that that's like a. Then maybe just this on every other wall. Black and white. That's quite a modern style, isn't it? We can put a picture up there and everything. Okay, should we put our door back now? Can I have my door back? Oh, I quite like. Oh, no, I don't know. Okay. Right, bear with me a second. I'm actually going to quickly save this and exit the game and turn my mods off. Um, so let's just switch back to chat and screen. It's just annoying me a little bit, so let's just turn them off. I have to restart the game for that though, so bear with it. It shouldn't take a second. So we're just going to quickly finish doing the re reloading this up and then we can get jump back into it. There's normally a way to refresh this without doing that. I always do 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 do. Come on. Refresh, damn you. I have to switch off and then back. I don't like doing that, but hey ho, it works. Cool. Let's just load the game up. Hopefully, this will fix the issue I was having with the move objects keep turning off, which was annoying the hell out of me. Let's jump in. Right, now let's see. Switch over to the game. Right, move objects is back on. We'll just see whether that remains on. I'm going to go with that door. So, a modern. Oops. Styles modern. So, I'm feeling like having something on this wall. I'm, I'm not sure. I mean, I quite like these, like, um, what do you call them? Living walls, but. Um, don't think it really fits there, to be honest. Maybe like panels. That's a really modern. I'm not sure that falls under modern. Some of the things that they put under modern are just crazy. I mean, some of the things I hate. I mean, I don't like that. But it, at least it fits in the modern bracket more. That's huge. I mean, you can always do that, size it down.
Is it coming in the other colours? Possibly. I'm not quite sure what it is, to be honest. Is it just like a dry leaf lattice? Interesting. We need to put some plants in the corner, of course. Of course. That's what we always do. Oh, I haven't done the floors. That would help. Um, is wood, is just plain wood a cop out? I don't know. I think I might do like the darker wood, offset the light woods, maybe. Hmm, yeah, let's do that. Do we have anything else that we could put in this room that would make it look nice? We're still on modern. We could put the pride flag up. Where'd that go best? I'm not sure, to be honest. No, we don't need that. No. No, 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 no. 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 Hmm, paintings, let's see. Have we got any good paintings we could put up here? That's quite nice. Does it mean I need two though? That's the thing. Maybe we do the smaller ones, we could do this one. We used this yesterday, but it works. It's like a face. I'm assuming they can get through that side, so I'm thinking I could put something at this side, like maybe a um, not a not a bar, but like a hutch type thing. Are they called hutches in here? Have we got any that are all on mod under modern? We do, but it's um, way too big and doesn't really fit what's meant to be in this room, so that's fine. Any other suggestions for something you'd like in this room, anyone? Obviously, we could put more flowers in, which is fine. Um, let's look under all storage. Some random stuff here. Could do like this here, but it's a bit off center. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I'm trying to find. I was trying to see if I could find like a cabinet or something to go there rather than just another painting. Um,. Maybe just something like this. This might work. All that, possibly. Oh, I know why this, the, um, my shadows will look a bit weird because I turned the graphics down yesterday. I forgot about that. Do we think this works? Does this come in a good color if they, to put this here though? That color would match better. And I think I need another plant in this corner to be honest. Um, I didn't check curtains actually, Bob. Let's have a look. We do have curtains. We do have curtains. Though, I'm thinking with it being modern, we should maybe go for blinds on most of the windows. Like this, maybe? I mean, the problem is with blinds is they're always down in The Sims. Obviously, curtains are open, so maybe we'll go for just some plain curtains. Like that, maybe. Rugs. Do we have any rugs? We should really put a rug down. You should always put a rug down in a in a dining room. That's too small. Why is it so big? It's like I want something in between the two. I've either got that one that's way too small. I mean I can size it up, but it's just that fills the whole room. I size this one down. Maybe the size down works, yeah. Actually, I might leave the blue because that takes from the win the um from the uh, windows. Okay, well let's put if we've got any clutter items or something for the table. We could put some flowers. I don't no, don't really class that as, as modern. Ooh. Random bowl in the middle of the table, maybe. Maybe some toxic waste in the corner. <laughs> no, not really. I'm joking. 
some magazines. Some, uh, no. Is that a scissors and stuff? No. Boxes? No. Suntan lotion? Oh, it's not suntan thing, I think. Yeah, was it? Yeah, sunblock. Maybe just that. Does this fit on this? Can you put anything on the shelf? No. We could do, actually, if we... Apparently this is modern. Little bear. No, stop snapping over there. I want you to be on this shelf here. Um, put you down by one. Uh, I bet you float, don't you? Ah, uh, he floats. That's annoying. Rude. Okay, well I think that's going to have to do for the dining room, I think. Okay, that's, that worked. We got everything in the room we needed, so I think we're fine. So living area, it's quite a big living area, so I'm thinking like we'll have like an office slash um... <gasps> Ooh, Bob. Controversial. So I'm thinking at this end we'll have like an office space slash library kind of space, and this end we'll have like the living area, proper living area. So let's see what we get. We're not going to do two different spins though, it's all one for that. Let's go, see what we get for our living area. Patio. <laughs> no, it was all going so well. Okay. So, patio for our living room. That's interesting. Um, patio. We will have some seating. Um, we, I might even put like <laughs> a hot tub in there. No, that is too big, really. So I, because I'm doing this room next, I need to do the doors into each of these. Let's do them first. I might not have doors. I do have doors. Not great doors, but like a big sliding door into the bedroom. I don't really want a big door though because I wanted to put like the TV over there. Oh man. <laughs> Why do I do this to myself? My, my only option really is either a glass door for the bathroom or this one. I think it has to be this one. I don't think we can have a glass door into the bathroom can we? Maybe we just use them for both. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going to happen with the TV right now. And then this needs to go. We can have a glass door into there. Yeah, that's all we've got. Yeah, I know, Bob. It's a nightmare. We can have a glass door into there. Then into the bedroom, maybe we do the same door. Maybe we just do all the same doors. Maybe I just replace that one. Something like that. And then do... I don't think we're going to have any walls for patio. This is my issue. Nope, no walls for patio. Any floors for patio? One floor for patio. So that's all we can have for the floor. Does it come in any other colours? It does. Maybe a lighter colour would help? Not overly. That's fine. Nice. Uh, right, anyway. What have we got for patio? So we have not much. We can have a barbecue. That would have been useful in the but in the kitchen, to be honest. We have some seating, which is good. So we've got some like rattan furniture. We've got some proper sofas because technically that is a nice sofa. Uh, well, not nice, but it's an okay sofa, and it goes with these chairs. And we've even got like a two-seater. Oh, we got a full set. That's good. We have some plants, which is always good. Not very big plants, but we have some plants. We have like a coffee table. Okay, so at least we can create a seating area. Do we have any lighting? Uh, all lighting. We have some wall lights. That might be where we need to go with this. Interesting. Right, so... I'm thinking... I kind of create. I haven't really done very well because I've got double doors for everything. It doesn't leave me much space. 
I'm thinking maybe the seating area goes in the middle. Sort of like, oh, that's not going to work. We need to do it this way, really. Do we have like a fireplace? Because I could put a fireplace here, couldn't I? If we have any. Maybe we have a fireplace? I don't know. Come on, they fall under now. Uh, where am I going? Living room fireplaces. There we go. No fireplaces for the rubbish. Of course there wasn't. Why would there be? Uh, what have we got today? Do we have anything that we could put there like a fireplace? We could put a war a lamp, like a warming lamp there. Fire pit. Do we have any fire pits? I'm not sure, to be honest. Under patio. We've got like a thingy bowl. Could size it up. Be like a big fire pit like that. Um, I can't see any fire pits, unfortunately. Uh, thank you very much for redeeming stretch. I can put this over here. Thank you. Oh, oh dear, mate. Um, right. It's really annoying we don't have any, like, single sized doors. Maybe, can I move you over to there, move you over to there, then put this here? That would work better, actually. That's not enough space then to get through there, unfortunately. So maybe we don't have that. There, we put you there. Maybe copy you. Have we got any like any surfaces to go between the two? That's not what we need, patio. Not over. I don't want to use that again, we used that yesterday. We've got nothing small to go between them, which is annoying, so that's not going to work. Decorations? Anything here useful? We've got some plants. Apparently this is patio, so that's something. Put you in the corner. Uh, coffee table. Do we have a coffee table? This is apparently a coffee table. We used this yesterday for our... Um, that seems huge for a coffee table. It seems very large, very tall. Oh, I don't really need this anymore for now. We need something like a TV, but not a TV. So let's see what we can find. Something for the wall here. That we can pretend is a TV. No, that's not. Maybe like a huge sculpture. Or maybe just some plants. We can just like the plant growing. Oh, oh, we could maybe be use this to cover up the walls a bit mm, I can't really cover all of them though that's the problem you there copy you bring you forwards a bit so that you're not so much in the in the Edge. Cover up the walls a little bit. It kind of covers them up, not entirely. Oh, we've got these too. We could put these nowhere. I've just filled everything in. I tell you what, we'll take this one out and we'll put this here. Then your entertainment can be watching the plants grow. Yeah, I think that sounds right. Yeah. Maybe, maybe that's what you're gonna do. You're gonna sit there watching the. T oh, it really annoys me. Everything's off center though. Maybe we just put one in the middle. Wait, is that under patio? Wait a minute, is that not under patio? No, it's not. Oh rubbish! I didn't have it filled quickly. Oh, poop. Let's put you back then. I'm not really sure what else I can put in here. I mean, I can put loads of plants in, which is fine. Um, there's not a lot of space for it. It's, it's quite zen, yes. 
We can have some sauce for the suckling pig when it comes out. Controversial, Bob. True, but controversial. So this is patio. We can put a vase in. A vase, maybe in this corner here. I want something behind it, really. Uh, is this a little smaller? Aha! Oh, here we go. Here we go. We can do that there. Put one here. Maybe put one. Oh, I didn't want that. Should I cover up as many of these blank walls as possible? Patio, making sure that I'm not using stuff I shouldn't be. That one needs to move over slightly though. It's about there. Maybe put some plants under the window. We colour them to be blue to match the sofa and stuff. Uh, let's see what other lights we've got. Do we like hanging lights? No, okay. So we've got like a lantern, so we can put a couple of them on the table. Maybe they really like the chess, so we'll, ooh, wrong button. We'll put like a, a knight there and a pawn there. Do they come in any other shapes? No, just other colours. Okay. Then maybe... Any wall lights? I think there were some wall lights, wasn't there? Yeah, here we go. You there. You there. Where have I put that one? How high up? Up to there. Mm. Perfect. I think that's perfect. Look at that beautiful living room. Wouldn't you love to live in that living room? I don't think there's anything else I can put on the walls though. Like above these, it would have been good to have something above these, but there isn't really, unless I lift everything up. But then we end up getting, let's see if I lift this up, what happens? Can we embed it inside itself? Ooh, possibly actually, you don't really see it. If I push it back far enough, you don't see it. I mean, when you put the walls down, you will from the other side, but no one cares about that. <laughs> let's do that. We can really cover the walls then, can't we? Uh, let's go up. And then push it back slightly just so you can't see the planter. It's about there. Yeah. I think that will be better. And what I say goes. Okay, and we need another one here. Cool. And then you almost can't tell that there's no wallpaper in this room, can you? No one would ever know. Um, hello, yeah, we always do that. I mean, the lighting's a bit weird, but I think that's because of the way I'm pushing into the doors, into the walls. But I think it should be fine. There we go. There's our beautifully decorated living room with our growing walls. It kind of looks all right. If it was an outside space, it's not that bad, but unfortunately it's not an outside space, so. Oh, well. So next, this is going to be a bit of a pain because <laughs> they're going to all stay there even when the walls are down. Not very good to play in, but you know, hey ho. So let's do the bathroom next. So let's see what we get for our first and only bathroom. Basics, okay. That shouldn't be difficult. 
in theory i'm reckoning we should get quite a good amount of stuff and basics that we need so that's going to be quite good for us yep so we've got a sink we have a toilet we should have a shower we should have a bath yeah we do we have everything we could ever need right where are the windows i can't remember Unfortunately, because this humongous door is not the best space, let's put. Do we want a bath, tub, and then a shower, maybe? I think that might be the best option. Yeah, I think I prefer that. Then we can get a sink underneath the window. Yeah, look at that. Right. So we've got the basic stuff in there. Get it? Basics. <laughs> um, we should have lots of wallpaper, I would think. Uh, not lots, but the only tiles we've got are these ones. Which, if we find a lighter colour, won't be too bad, actually. Maybe like white. Black trim, maybe. Basics on the floor. We have the same tiles. Yeah. Oh god, that's not the same one. Is that the same one? I think it is, but yeah, it's just slightly lighter. Yeah, I quite like the tiles. I'm not sure I'd want the full room tiled like that, but personally, maybe actually, I could do half the room not in tiles and just this half in tiles, maybe? Yeah. Oh, I wonder. Oh, we could do like these go with the tiles on the wall, mm, but the pattern doesn't really show very well in here, unfortunately. No, not really. Nah, we'll leave it as is. Uh, so, what else can we put in here? I wonder if we've got any. I wonder if the toilet paper fits uh, sits under basics I can't remember off the top of my head where it is so we've got the soap we could put the soap on the t on the sink if we raise it up and alt place it I can figure out when I'm at the right level that's the problem to get down by one doesn't it uh, down by one Oh, up by one. It's going to float. Oh man, why is everything floating? Is that floating? No, I think we're alright. I think we're alright. Yeah, cool. Do we have anything like... I don't think we've got the toilet paper. No, we've got tissue. Maybe we just put this on the back of the toilet. This is what you wipe your bum with. balance it on the back of the toilet like like so okay that's what you gotta wipe your bum with because there isn't anything else from what I can see unless it falls under ah wait yes we do actually it falls under the miscellaneous not the cluster items that's good <laughs> so you get some toilet paper that's good that's good <laughs> we can have some towels oh I don't like that colour though I want one with the rail a bit lighter. Hmm. Doesn't really go with the style of the room. Um. The issue with basics is there's quite a lot of stuff under it, so trying to find stuff to go. Or like a cleaning bucket. We could put like a cleaning bucket in here. Pretend like somebody's cleaning. Goes under the sink. Why are you on such a... I mean, I obviously feel the same about them, but why are you specifically today on such a big um, attack them day? Something happened that I haven't noticed today in the news. I'm not saying you shouldn't do, because I agree with you, but I'm just wondering whether there's something specific from today that I don't know about.
Basically, yeah, see, basics is a big category, so there's a lot of stuff here. Um, oh, do we have a mirror or something? We do. Medicine cabinet. I don't know why it seems so high. I don't know why, but it just seems so high. Mm, you don't really want to look at yourself on the toilet. Okay, no, that makes sense. Maybe there? Ooh, actually, ooh, what have I done there? Hello? Oh, I sized it up. Didn't mean to. One button. I don't know, is that weird? I don't really like the towels being there, that's my issue. I need some better towels. I, don't, I, I like the towels, I just don't like that particular... the swatches. I just think there's anything else I can use. Mm, no. Okay, they'll stay there for now. What else have we got? Have we got any curtains? Oh, yeah, I thought you were home. You always tell when you're home because the dog goes running down the stairs at 10,000 miles per hour. <laughs> Hello. Mm. Classic curtain. Ugh, it looks so drab. Lovely, look. <laughs> So that's the colour it is there. As soon as you put it over the window, that's the colour it becomes. That's so annoying. Well, they're huge. So nice. Why? Why are the windows making the curtains go such funny colours? Um, can I lift you up slightly? No, I don't want to size you down. No, stop sizing you down. No, you won't go any higher than that. I really hate the colour. Why do you keep doing this? I don't think I want the cut. Oh wait, is it because I haven't put any lighting in? Might be. Might be. Oh, we've got the saucers. Yay! I could just do that. There we go. That makes so much life so much easier. I might put a light over it. Do we have any good ones? Oh god. Yeah, we'll leave it like that. Right, do any of these now look better now that we've put that up? Kind of, they still change colour when you put them over the windows, which is a bit annoying. Not as bad as they were though, so maybe we'll just put a couple of those in. We need to pull the sink forwards. Which is a bit weird considering... Actually, let's... On that window, let's put... A... That blind's huge! Oh, wrong button. You wouldn't have seen that, but I just switched screens by accident. You know what? It's going to clip. I don't care. Yes, I do. It's going to annoy me. It's just so far away from the wall now. I think I'm just not going to have a curtain there. We don't need a curtain there. You need one curtain. Um, right. But well, we're not on basics anymore. I don't think. No, we're not. Just be careful, Dan. There we go. <gasps> toothbrush. We can put toothbrush holder. I'll place you on the back of the sink too. There we go. I think we need some... Maybe a picture above the toilet or something. We still need a proper... Still need a proper mirror. Because normally I'd put it above the, the sink, but maybe it just goes above the toilet. Not the best place for it, but you know, hey-ho. We got anything we could put underneath the window? Oh, wait, rug. We could maybe put. Have we got any small rugs? <laughs> Loads of rugs. Put one there. Look. I'm not sure I like the colour, but what colours we got? Maybe the blue. We could have one by the bath as well. Look at that. We have rugs. Oh, it's nice when that happens. Ah, oh, there's the other tower rack. Wait a minute. Do I sell on basics? Nope, that's why. Food. Have we got any plants that we could put in here? We could put like... Whoa, that's big. That's what she said. Maybe... Uh, I tell you what, cluster items. Do we have a jar of olives? Should we put in a jar of olives? No. I was hoping to go on the side of the bath, really. I was hoping the 
Right, toiletries was in this men's cologne. Hmm, not really what you'd put on the side of a bath. However, it would work. Uh, toilet. They seem quite big. These would fit. Yeah, let's put this on the side of the bath. Are you floating? Are you floating? I think you are. <laughs> I think you are. Mm, I don't know whether it's going to work. Mm, up by one more. No, unfortunately that's not going to work. Fine. Do we have any... <laughs> Thought you might get the reference, Bob. We have some shells. Ooh. Ah. Maybe. We do this instead. Maybe not in that colour, though. Whoop. Not the button I meant to press. I always do that. Now we have space to put stuff on the shelves. Not that I have much to go on the shelves, but you know, hey ho. We can put the men's cologne up there, though, that we just found, because that should, in theory, go on the shelf fine. See, there we go, look. We could put these. Now, those things look huge. The bath's going to fit. Um, nope. What else can we put? Maybe a dog and a cat? Golden cat? Some frying pans? Some lemons? Nope, that's not going to be snapped onto there. Pencils, you never know when you might need them in the bathroom to work something out. Cotton buds, there we go. Why don't they go on the shelves? That's really annoying. You should fit on the shelves. Literally, you're made to go on shelves. Uh, are you floating? Please say you're not floating. Bet you're floating. It's so annoying if you are. Surprisingly not. Okay. That's good, that's good. Um seems a bit weird. Ooh, will these fit on here? No, they're not gonna fit on here. More tissues would, so we can put them there. Laundry detergent would fit there. Oh, we could have done laundry in here as well. Okay, well. Maybe some spare toothbrushes. Um, we got stuff to go on here. Maybe we'll just do two shelves. We'll take this shelf out. We'll pretend it wasn't there to begin with. What is that? Oh, that's like dog food. Okay. Anything else? Can we fit maybe a cat? Of course, that would be... Nutcracker? Oh, he's a lot bigger than I always think he is. Yeah, he's huge. Kind of fits. Maybe we just do this. There we go. Whoa. Can you maybe turn the right way for me? No. Come on. Come on. Okay, well, let's try. There we go. I'll do. I was trying to do alt placing, it wasn't working. Okay, well, I think that's our bathroom pretty much done. Not much else we can get in there, to be honest. Well, I could put, like, a painting on the wall there, I suppose. Let's see what we've got. Something basic, as it were. Like a poster. Seems a bit weird to have them on the wall in the bathroom. <laughs> um, I think oh, we can have like a mouse hole I'm thinking no for the wall unless none of it really makes any sense being on the wall here so we'll just leave it as is we could put this on the wall I suppose didn't really like that one but got like a white swatch not really. Yeah, that'll do. Matches the door. There we go. That's our bathroom. Not too bad, I don't think. 
So next it's the bedroom, the master bedroom. What's that clipping through the wall? Oh, it's not, it's the wallpaper. I already did a bath mat, I did two of them. See? Uh, right, master bedroom. So let's see if we get anything that we can actually use. Positive vibes. Farmhouse. That will work. We can use farmhouse. That's alright, Bob. Doesn't matter. So, farmhouse should be. That allows you to go with the outside of the house quite well, I think. Because obviously, at the moment, the outside of the house is um, stone, which is kind of farmhousey. Right. So we have a bed, we have at least one bed. Do we have multiples? Oh, we could do... Uh, we could do a four poster bed. That might be a bit too much and it's right by... It would have to be there, I think, if we're going to do that. Because of the window. Is it too much, though? That's the question. I mean, we could go standard and just do a normal bed, which is this one. What do we think? Do we think? I'm not really sure that's farmhouse, to be honest. But that I think that's um, from, yeah, from um, realm of magic. Uh, what have we got for? Oh, thank you. Thank you, Frankie. So rubbish at that. I always forget. So we've got two beds under farmhouse, double beds. Um, as I was saying, sorry. Um, what have we got for side tables? So that might help us with the style. So we could use that style. We could use that style with that one potentially. It will do, and um, probably not many, oh, more than I thought. So we've got some nice light colours. Oh, different glass on the top. Like plain white, it's very bright. All purple. That's quite nice. Like ones with moon on the top. Or black. I swear that the swatches weren't like that before. I've only got them outside because it's easier to see the colours of everything at the moment with it outside because I haven't done the lights yet. I think if I was to do that bed, I'd probably do that bedside table with it. Then I'd do this one. Yeah, it's quite nice. Maybe we'll do that then. From that. That matches. Yeah, okay. We only have one bedside table because it kind of needs to go against this wall. It's really the only wall it can go against because the other one's got windows. So that's not great. Let's see what we do for lighting. Have we got, have we got much farmhouse? We have a fair few bits. Uh, all. Okay, well we have some lights. Uh, it's going to be a bit difficult to put lights in. We might have to do like bedside table light. Maybe some wall light. The problem is I can't get the wall, the light in the middle of the room because of where the bed is. So it would have to be like here. It could be. Um, just We wouldn't have a bedside table though. That's the downside really. You'd have to have a table at the end of your bed. I mean, really, what else do we need in the room? That's that's the thing. It's kind of like that. Maybe a dresser. I'm not sure we need it. We need the space. It's just the lights are annoying me. But I can do... Yeah, I can still put seating in here, though. Like here. Put a dresser in the corner. It should still work. And actually, if I shifty this up, this way ever so slightly. Put you 
there and you there. Here's more space than I can have a dresser and a seating and seating there. No, that's um, more paper from the other side. I painted both sides back, so I don't know how I'm going to do that. That doesn't mind me. We'll do. We'll, let's just do the lighting quickly first. Maybe I just do wall lights. Use them already. Am I filtered still? Farmhouse, yes. <laughs> or maybe just standing. Oh, why are some of these lights so bad? Well, let's put this on the bedside table. That'll help. Maybe just go for this style. That'll do for now. Let's look at the walls then. What walls have we got under farmhouse? In theory, we should have a fair few, I would have thought. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Brick, or we have this style. Which I think that's going to have to be one of these styles. If we've got, like, a colour... What's... It's black, so we want... I think we want a lighter colour on the wall to offset the black bed, personally. Um, I don't really want to go black on dark but I suppose it would work actually maybe this one and then if we can sit here and do the alternate ones because you're meant to do the alternating there you go yeah, you're meant to do the alternating the alternating patterns kind of helps it look a bit better I could do that actually. I think it looks okay. Farm ass on the floor. I don't really want this type of flooring because this the problem with this type of flooring is it has the pattern, but in, I kind of want to place it myself. So I'm thinking I'm probably gonna have to go for this one. Like a so. I think that works. Let's check for curtains. Do we have any curtains for farmhouse? Ugh, why is it always this type of curtain? They're way too big for this room. I think we can't have curtains, so that's fine. Get more curtains anyway. We could have a fireplace. There's not enough space for that. I wonder if there's um And there's only two fireplaces. There is like a um, wood burner type fireplace, but it's obviously not under farmhouse, which I find a bit weird. Sometimes their categorization of objects is a bit weird. I'm sure there's a, like a... Yeah, see, I would have probably put something like this. I mean, it's kind of modern, but that could have fallen under farmhouse. It's like a wood burner, I suppose. Meh. We can't, we can't use it though, so... No point crying over spilled milk. So we need a dresser. Uh, bedroom? Yeah. These are my mind. So I'm thinking we're going to be having a lot of this realm of magic stuff. Because why do I always do that? Because it matches the, matches the bed. I mean, we could go this one but it doesn't really match the room though maybe it does maybe maybe in that color oh actually that does kind of match and they're not going all of the same set which is okay I suppose then we can have a chair right we could either have like an ottoman at the end of the bed or we could have a something underneath the window what have we got not a lot. Hay bale, anyone? Hay bale? Looks like it's going to be a sofa. Maybe like a two-seater sofa. We don't have like an ottoman. Maybe I just put like this here. Now, this is my thing. Now, I automatically try and centre it with the bed, but should it be centred with the room rather than the bed? 
what would annoy you more, to be honest? Like, in terms of aesthetics, would you centre it with the, cent the bed or the room? I'm not sure. I always go for the bed just because. Oh, is that really all that we've got? Um, just because I think it looks better, but. Not very much in terms of farmhouse. Oh, what have we got here? Have we got anything interesting? Cluttered mind box. Picture. Some scan scanners. Canisters. Oh. Okay. Like a towel rack. We could put this in if we could get this in a good colour. Ooh, ooh that actually matches that, doesn't it? Yeah, I think it does. In the corner or something. Yeet. Yeet. Maybe like that. Maybe put it really close. Like so. Oh, that's oh, right over the window. Meh, you're never going to see it. Okay. There's not a lot of wall space to put stuff on. We could put a, some paintings out or something on either side of these walls. Oh, we've got um, the antique posters which come in um, various different people. So we've got some different frames, so let's go for a dark frame with that gentleman, maybe that lady. Can we put... I'm not going to leave these ones here, I'm going to see what we've got. Her maybe, and her. Okay. So we could do sort of a picture wall. Maybe like that? Is that weird? Would you wake up in the middle of the night and be freaked out by that? I think I would. But hey ho. Oh, we're not on farmhouse anymore. They were under farmhouse, weren't they? Hopefully they were. There were a few good, good goods. Um, I was looking to see if we had any lights to go above them, like to light the pictures, but they're a bit big. They're a bit harsh. They could put more of these above them, but no. No, I think that's fine there. Um, what else can we put in the room? Oh, rug. Have we got any rugs? Again, this is where the question is going to be with the um, with that sofa. Whether it's going to work. Oh, we could put a runner in. Do we have the other end? Don't like the middle piece. I'm assuming there is the middle piece for it. There we go. Okay, 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 okay. Maybe sort of there? That then would mean this has to be there. Hmm. It's gonna annoy me. Uh, it's gonna annoy me. <laughs> what do I do? Ah, uh, <laughs> doesn't work. Maybe that is off centre because there's a side table next to it. Oh, man. Maybe just put another one of these ones in. In the black. Ooh. About that one, to be honest. Yeah. There we go, and then we can put something on that table. Maybe some clutter. Have we got any clutter items? Not really. Chicken for the eggs, maybe? Spice rack. There we go. Camera. There we go. Somebody's into their photography. Anything else? Anybody wants in the room? I'm not sure about this really. I might have to change. I might get rid of this to be honest. I don't think I like it. Yeah, I might just put something else there. Any sculptures that would look good there? Maybe just some sticks in a milk urn type thing. What do you call it? Not urn. There we go. I think that'll do. 
So in the back garden, please, uh, we need to do the back garden now, so I'm going to like section it off. If I get a fence, and then we'll do stuff in the back garden. Uh, save that, which includes the patio as well, like decorating the patio. So let's see if we get anything. Come on, give me something. Mission decor. Mission. Mission. Don't know what that means. Do we have anything for mission under the fences? Where's mission? We have something. We can have a fence. We can have a proper fence. I'm thinking I'm going to like do maybe to there. And across to here. Then maybe to here. Thinking maybe this is our garden. Then this can, if we've got a, a gate, we have gates too. We're being spoiled. We can have a gate there. Do we have a bin? What do we have under mission? Probably nothing. Uh, not really much else. That's the problem. No outdoorsy stuff. Do have a sofa type thing, so we can put that on the uh, on here. What's that? I don't know. With some lights here either side of the window. Do we get anything like? We get no. Oh, we get some plants. Not very great plants. If we size up. There we go. We have that there. We can put this size you up slightly too. A little bit weird, but there we go. There you go. Ooh. Oh, that's huge. <laughs> Do we get any flowers and stuff? No, no flowers. <laughs> we get nothing else. What? Stairs doesn't really help us. Some columns. Man. Window, like, balconies don't really help us. Well, we have a back garden, I just can't put anything in it. What else can we put in here? Um, where's it gone? Show all. We're still on mission? Yeah, still on mission. So we could put in some more lights no, no, I don't like that mm -hmm. I don't think to, we could do terrain paint because terrain paint doesn't fall under anything so terrain tools or do they I don't think any of the terrain tools come with Packs. Oh, they do, so we can't cheat and do that. I think if they didn't come with any packs, then we could, uh, any styles. Or maybe, maybe they do. Not pack styles. I think we can get away with using terrain paint. Um, so we can at least put in, like, a path or something. Um, let's do it square, actually. A bit bigger than that though. A bit smaller than that though. We can have like patio area here. Maybe to here. Cool. Then we can put on some, I don't know, some more chairs maybe, mission decor. Or 
something. What was under mission to cool? We had something. We had some other bits. Here we go. Maybe we just put... There are no... Just put another, like... Or, or maybe... Have we got dining room stuff? No, no dining room stuff. Living chair... Okay, let's put a couple of... Let's move you to there for a second. You there. I'm not sure I like that. Let's take you out. Let's move you to like... Move you over slightly. You don't mean that close. And then there looks a bit like a coffee table. Mega table, dining room table. Oh, we do actually have. Oh, actually, instead of these, we could put an outdoor dining area. I, didn't, I wasn't. I didn't see it for some reason. There we go. An outdoor dining area. So we've got some chairs that can go at it. I mean, so probably need treating because it's going to like rot in the uh, rain and stuff. But hey ho. Um, we'll leave its default colour, I think. Oh, we did have a coffee table, though. Maybe that can go here. Outdoor seating area. Tiny globe. and go on the table for the hell of it. Maybe plant on the table in the middle. Do we have any other terrain paint that I could use to spruce it up a bit? Could use like these flowery things. None of them are really overly flowery though. Do this. I'll have to put in a um Might be a bit too much, but like covering the whole thing in that. But hey ho. I can't have anything else, so this is it, to be honest. There we go. Nicely decorated. Get there. <laughs> Lovely. Isn't it beautiful? <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Uh, anything else to go out here? We don't really want a hutch out here. There's no bars, is there? No. We could put like a grandfather clock. Maybe a rug underneath here so we have a proper outdoor area. Again, don't leave it out. Got a desk. Some books on the table. Hmm. That's interesting, to say the least, I can tell you that. Oh, we haven't done the little um, entrance hall either. I need to do that next. So we'll do that. Okay, so let's see what we can get for the little entrance hall. Give me something contemporary, okay. Contemporary, contemporary, contemporary. Well, actually, there's not much I can put in here because it's so small. But uh, let's check the floors. Ooh. Oh, thank you. Sorry. Lucky I haven't really looked at anything yet, so. Thank you very much. My, um, I will get it right at some point. It's the first time I've sort of done it this way, so it's um, it's getting used to it. That's my issue. Right, we don't have much of a choice for the floors. We've got this spotty floor is the only option we have really for our entrance. So we don't. It doesn't even come in. Does it come in any other colours? So it's this one. It does come in other colours. We could do like a grey colour actually. Uh, 
Um, what have we got? Do like a stone entrancey type thing, maybe. Kind of work. Do we have any surfaces contemporary? What have we got? Counters? We've got some counters. Oh, actually, we could put these here. It's like a. Uh... Oh, why do we never have the right. Yeah, it's it's just a bit of a nightmare to remember sometimes. Shame you can't like get it to automatically do it. It wouldn't obviously it would never know how when to do it, but you know. Um maybe this one actually. Yeah. There we go. Do you have any I'm just thinking of like a uh I know it didn't. I know it's not really a kitchen, well it's not a kitchen at all, but I was thinking we could do something... It's pink. What colour did I pick on that one? We could have like cabinets here. So it's almost like a boot room and this is where you could put your little... Um, you put all your stuff, like your dog's leads and stuff. We've got... Oh that is. Oh it's like lamps, okay. I'd like to stick that there. I should really get I should, next time. I'll use debug as well because that would help me. That might be one of my next challenges: is um, building a house just with debug. Uh, what have we got? Oh, you, you're gonna need a mirror, don't you? You need a mirror in your little entrance hall. I don't know. That one's way too high. that one either to be honest but they all seem so high I don't know why some plants so we can put you in there I'm annoyed that the little um, coat rack doesn't seem to come under this either put you there all the shoes the shoes would be useful just to put on the floor there Hmm. What else have we got under contemporary? A hell of a lot, but it's just like. I could put like a chair in here, I suppose. You might want to sit down. As close to the wall as possible. Maybe. Maybe a rug, possibly. Um, ooh, I need one that's not quite that big. I really want a small rug, really. What colour does this come in? Like a light colour, but not too light. Texture's really bad on that, but I don't know whether that's just good. I didn't turn my graphics down that much, though. It seems really low, even for that. What do, Can we size this one down? Any, uh, that would work, maybe. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. I really wanted some clutter items for here, but there's not really anything. We could put a llama in. Why in the hell not? Maybe another box, sort of with this one. Somebody's not tidying up after themselves, maybe? Got paintings, there's nowhere to put paintings now in this room. Yeah, I think we're done there, I think. I think we're done there, yeah. Okay, anything else? I think that's every room done. There was nothing else we could really get in the garden, to be honest with you. Definitely have to come back and re um, visit these. So let's go and get our sim. Uh, manage world, save manage worlds, and let's get her to move in. Just so we could do a tour of the house. Where is she? She's here. To Victor, move our household and move her in. Oh, I need to turn free real estate on. Oh, let's move in here. Oh, my house from yesterday, somebody downloaded it off the gallery. 
is interesting. So we went for a single floor today, so let's see. Um, yeah, it does a bit cranky. So, our entrance, our front garden isn't great. Actually, before I do that, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna roll for the front garden, see if we can get anything good for the front garden. Just do that quickly. Let's just see if we get anything from the garden, because I want to get some flowers in at least. And if we can get them in the front garden, then that would help. So let's do that. Let's see whether we get anything. If we don't get anything for it, then that's fine. Mid-century, that's what we use. That was the one we had to remove, wasn't it? Yeah, we've got to remove that one, so I can't use that one. I forgot to remove it earlier. Storybook, okay. So we get storybook for the front garden. Let's just see whether we get anything. If we don't, then that's fine. It's just, it was an idea. Oh, we still get nothing. We get some fences, but I've already done... Not really. What falls under storybook? A lot of furniture. We could at least put these in to make it look a bit nicer, I suppose. Oh, some flower boxes, maybe. There we go. This is coming out of her money now, because I moved her in. We can at least get something in so it looks a bit better. I can't really put anything on the pat. I suppose it could do. No one cares. Yeah, there we go. What else is under storybook? Nice little bird bath. This one is not much. Right, another colour, a lighter colour. That'll do. Um, well, we didn't get any extra plants, which is annoying. Again, I don't know the plants come under. They must do, but I'm not sure. No, well, if we'd gotten garden, that would have been useful. I think that's probably the only thing that would have been useful. I'm just looking to see what else falls under the other styles. Oh, well, French country would have got something. Not very much, but... Patio even doesn't come with anything. Yeah, I think basics would have been good, but we've already used that one, or um, garden. Okay, so let's do our tour then, because we've done something on the outside of the house. Let's quickly go and tour the house. Let's go. Oh, horrible weather now. I swear it wasn't rubbish weather just a second ago. So, zoom, zoom out. Let's go down. Whoa, too far. So this is our inch. Oh, that bit didn't get painted. Oh, well, we'll pretend we do not see it. So firstly, you go into our entrance, which is um, in the modern it, um, style, I think. Yeah. Isn't too bad. Nothing exciting. I didn't put any lights in. Oh well. Never mind. Little place to put your keys and put your leads and stuff. Um, that door in the corner will never open because of the uh, moulding above the door. But hey ho, you don't need to get in there anyway. I've uh, got some clipping through the walls of course, which takes us into our living room themed around the patio. Oh, my frame rate's dropping again. Why is my frame rate dropping? Stop dropping. There's not even much in here. Put some head in. Yep, a living living room. 
I'm sorry that the frame rate's so rubbish, but um, I will go through it slowly just so it doesn't lag so much. I don't know why it's dropped so badly. We've got our kitchen in the industrial style, which I thought looked quite nice, apart from it missing half of the uh, bits that it actually needs. Uh, but yeah, we've got a little pantry. We've got an overhead extraction fan, overcooker extraction fan, but no cooker. We've got a sink. Instead of a bin, we've got a dumpster. Because who needs a sink? Nice little light on the wall. Yeah, that one's not too bad. Then through here, we've got our dining room. Which again, isn't too bad. This was in the mid-century style. This is one of the best rooms, I think, in the house. Uh, the bedroom's not too bad, actually, but yeah, so that's not too bad. Across the living room, it's this living room that causes the frame rate to drop, so I apologise about that. We've got our little bathroom, which again, actually isn't too bad. I think that went quite well. So I'm just watching my frame rate drop. It just dropped to 13 frames per second. Um, so hopefully... It, um, it sorts itself out but yeah this is our bathroom which wasn't too bad i can't remember what style that was in now and then lastly inside the house we've got the bedroom which was in the farmhouse style not too bad though we've got everything you need in about a bedroom really a bed and dresser it's all you need and finally we had outside oh i've gone too far we had the Mission decor outside. You got a seating area and a dining area. Again, this wood would need treating because it's all indoor furniture technically. But hey ho. But yeah, that's our house. And then the outside of the house was in the something style. What style was that in again? Farmhouse? Oh, we we used farmhouse twice. I think that's farmhouse. Let's just check. And check because the roof. Was it a farmhouse? No, it wasn't. What was it on the outside of the house? I can't remember now. I honestly can't remember what the outside of the house was on, what the style was. Oh, was it mid-century? Oh, do we move, use mid-century twice? Oh, well. Yeah, so that's our house. I'll upload it to the gallery in case anybody wants it. I can't imagine anyone would, but um, yeah, that's it. Um, yeah, I will do next time, Bob. I'm going to move the little post box because that comes in automatically. Put you there. But yeah, that's going to be it for today. Again, managed to get it to two hours, I think. In one of the next ones, um, oh, what's your challenge idea, Bob? See, so I think in one of the next ones soon, I'm gonna do a what's the word I'm thinking of? A reverb of one of these houses um, to make it look a bit better using every pack, like not a natural challenge. Um, either this one or the one from yesterday. I think that'd be quite nice. Mm. There's a couple of other challenges that I can do, which is um, a different budget per room. Uh, I'm just going to zoom in a bit and just get rid of everything on the outside because that should make my frame rate go back up. Um, so build the rooms first and then... Um, then spin to see what each room is to build a, like a shell and then yeah that would work you could do that That's definitely possible I think you'd have to go to the extreme wouldn't you you'd have to build like a really tiny room that you're expecting to be the bathroom so like a I don't know three by two even that is not that small when it comes to bedroom because you can still fit a single bed in it uh, and then you'd do a huge room that would be like your kitchen, potentially what you want to be your kitchen, but it turns out to be your bathroom and that sort of thing. Yeah, it would work, Bob. Yeah, definitely good, good idea, good idea. But yeah, okay, that would make, yeah, doing upstairs as well would definitely be better, maybe even a basement. 
haven't done basement for a while. But yeah, that's where I'm going to end it. Hopefully everyone enjoyed that. Um, hopefully you're all enjoying my new Sims content. Because I'm trying to diversify a bit with the Sims content. And um, uh, yeah, do something different. Um, obviously not different in terms of Simmers because lots of people do this. Um, but I just, for me, a kind of Simming relaxes me a lot more than others, other games. So... I figured I'd do a bit of this for a while and see how I get on. And um, yeah, so that's kind of why I'm doing it. I'm just seeing who's online to raid. So I'm just looking at my phone, sorry. And my friend Homo Joe Gaming is streaming. He's only got one viewer at the moment, so uh, let's go and give him some love because um, I've got a few. Um, so hopefully. That's not how I stream, that's not how I raid. I've completely pressed the wrong buttons on mine. Um, yeah, he's currently playing something called Heroes of the Storm. It has nothing to do with what I'm playing because it looks like a battle type game. But as I said, he's only got one view at the moment, so we might as well give him a bit of love. Um, yeah, Bob, I will, I will try and get through as many of them as possible. That's fine. Uh, but anyway, I hope everyone's enjoyed watching. Um, I've enjoyed doing it and um, I will do some more soon. Um, next stream is Thursday, which is meant to be the Nuzlocke, which I'm not sure I'm going to be doing that much more because it really does, I've, my head just can't cope with it. Um, in terms of it's quite um, difficult to do, so that you obviously have to um, grind a lot, but we'll see. Um, but. As I said, I'm going to upload this to the gallery. If anyone plays Sims and they want it, then you can download it. You can refurb it. If you feel like refurbing it, do it and then maybe send me a picture of what it looks like. Um, that's up to you. You don't have to. But thank you very much for watching. I hope everyone's enjoyed it. I know I've said that like four times now, but hey. I um, hope everyone has a good afternoon, evening or morning. Take care of yourself. Stay safe. Stay sane. Stay awesome. 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 And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.